Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to VSW Fireball. My name <laughs> there's a dog. My name is Jem Rock. Here with Scented Candle. It's time for open our opening contest for the night. Oh! A matchup between Big Bird and Cookie Monster. Oh, here we go. Set up last Whoa. week. Cookie and Elmo were debating <laughs> who would get a shot at Big Bird, and Cookie Monster oh. gets his chance in his first ever singles match here in VSW. Yeah. I try to pick up Cookie Monster for a power bomb here. He's just so oh. big. For an attack like that, oh! a senton, and ah! Cookie Monster showing out in his first ever record matchup here in Miss W. It's good for Elmo, oh, big slam <laughs> there. Cookie Monster just wants Big Bird and Elmo and him all be friends. Big Bird with a shot to the face, capitalizing there for the moment. Oh, oh! What a lightning drop right to the throat. And Cookie Monster able to get the shoulder up right now. He's in deep, deep trouble, wa deep waters right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Face buster and a kick right to the face. Yeah, I don't know what Big Bird's problem is. Like, <laughs> oh he's the one that, he's the one that's picking all the fights. Yes, it, oh no, he's climbing the top rope here. Oh, oh! Cookie Monster with a splash on the top it's rope. Up, oh! Big Bird, a deep deep troll for a train ride. Ah! My God, his feathers may fall oh! out on that one. He kicks out and a kick right to the face from Big Bird. Two of the newest superstars on the roster in the last oh. few months. Going out of here. And Cookie Monster's only here. Ah! Just speaking of the devil because of Elmo. Big Rock! Oh, oh, no. Cookie Monster hitting Elmo by mistake. No, 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 Two cents. Oh, ah! Big Bird has defeated Cookie Monster in his debut one-on-one -on -one match. And Big Bird is dancing a storm over here. And Cookie <laughs> can't believe that that, ha that, that, that that just happened. And don't forget tonight. The rivalry is going to come to an end. Hopefully. As Spongebob takes on Patrick. Well, what does Spongebob think about this match? Let's hear from him right now. Spongebob, can we have a word with you? Eh, hey, what do you want? Uh, if you have, you have your match with Patrick tonight, hopefully to end the rivalry. Sorry, there's a dog over there. Yeah, I see it. Uh, what are your thoughts on this match before you go into it? Eh, hey, well, honestly, we've been beat for a long time. And I just want to end this and move on to bigger and better things. Perhaps win some more championships. So, hey, if it's going to take beating Patrick down, that's what it's going to take. It's got a point. SpongeBob looking to end that feud with Patrick. And don't forget, November 18th is VSW Frenzy Brand versus Brand, where it'll be Fireball Superstars against Spike Superstars. And to earn points, and one of those matchups is Elmo and Luigi match for one point. Every point matters at VSW Frenzy. Yeah, one point, it could make all the difference. <sighs> that hurt my head. Cookie Monster are so big and thick. <laughs> Running into me. Elmo. You do you doing alright, Elmo? I, mean, I saw you hurt your head out there. How you feeling? Yeah, I hurt my head. The cookie Monster ran into me and uh. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What was that, Elmo? What? I was just coming out there to watch. You know, you know what? That was my business. If it wasn't for you, I would have won my first singles match, and you blew it for me. I didn't blow nothing for you. You should have not taken your eye off the prize. You literally made it about yourself. It was Cookie Monster versus Big Bird. Elmo was nowhere to be in that. Well, honestly, I. Well, honestly. If anyone should be mad, it's me. You ran your big, thick body into me and really hurt my head. And you really, you should have been out there to begin with. That's what I just said. You know, I'm tired of you. I'm tired of you making me look bad. Oh, boys, boys, boys. Boys, calm down. Calm down. Uh, Bowser, I want something done, out, I'm done about this. I want Elmo in a match next week. Yeah, Bowser, I wouldn't mind kicking this big boy's butt. Uh, Elmo, I don't think that's a good idea. You have a match at Frenzy that week. But don't worry, Bowser. I'll still be there at Frenzy. I just want to kick his butt and stop him and Big Bird from putting my name in their mouth. I'm just trying to make all friends again. You're just causing more issues. You know what? If you guys want a match, you guys can have a match next week. Come on, Cookie. Get out of here. Oh my oh! god! Luigi! What? Luigi, what's he doing here? What was that about? He's not even on this show. We have to look. I'm trying to refocus here. Looking back a few weeks ago, when Winnie the Pooh got attacked by oh. Pac-Man and Plankton, we still haven't heard any reasoning from this duo for the such attack on Winnie the Pooh. Not to mention last week as well, costing Winnie the Pooh the YouTube Championship. Yeah, it looks, it looks like Pac-Man Pac and Plankton are gonna make a team or something. Oh, oh my God! And that was the Pixel Power. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all must be wondering why we've been attacking Winnie the Pooh as of late. Honestly. It's because we're being disrespected. Because the, the management has something against us. That's right. Look at us. We were both former champions. I was the Intercontinental Champion. And he was the YouTube Champion. And what happened? 
Yeah, honestly, because I did defend my title in a cage match, a cage match, and then he had to defend his title against a community poll? How's that even fair? And honestly, why weren't we even in the Scrumble Rumble? How is that fair? Pickers are choosers, I guess, by the GMs. Yes, you know what? We're, we're done listening to management. We do what, I, what we want, when we want. And you know what's the best part, Plankton? They can't do anything. <laughs> That's right, because I went up to the higher-ups, and me and Pac-Man have signed some exclusive contracts here with VSW, so you can't fire us, or you'll be fined. Or worse, GMs. We will no longer be known as team sitting on the sidelines. Ha ha ha. We'll be known as the chum game. Exclusive contracts? How does it even work? <laughs> I don't even know. But SpongeBob and Patrick still have come one on one. Let's go back to VSW Frenzy as we saw this last week on Spike. All these matchups are going to be worth points and everything. We saw Elmo. Luigi wasn't even supposed to be here earlier, and we're still trying to figure out who's going to be that other matchup. Big show coming up. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your GM on Fireball, Bowser, here. Um, just to give a little update, Elmo's doing fine. His head injury is getting a little bit worse after Luigi, who doesn't even belong here, ambushed him. But he will still be at Frenzy, and we're still going to pick up the dub. Speaking of Frenzy, it is Bran versus Bran, and you know that. And there's some matches worth points, and there's one more match left to be determined who will be representing Fireball against ugh, ugh, Spike. Well, I'm here to introduce the individual it's representing Fireball, the Intercontinental Champion, making his comeback, Wazzy! It's Wazzy! 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 Wazzy. 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 The Intercontinental Champion is back! Hey, Bowser, uh, where, where's the sign at? Oh, uh, we, we got lost in the uh, transportation, the semis on the highway and stuff. It's a whole thing. Oh, I, I believe that makes sense. But anyways, um, I'm glad you picked me to represent Fireball at Frenzy. I will not let this brand down. Oh, you won't. I believe in you. Uh, you're one of the best here on Fireball. So, no matter who the Chicago Bear pairs you against, I know you're going to bring home the dub. Oh, I believe that. I believe Fireball. This brand gave me a chance to be who I am today. I will not let you down. Gorsh? <laughs> wow, what a surprise! <laughs> you picked Wazzy and not your top star here on Fireball, Goofy. Goofy, what are you doing out here? Look, everybody, it's the worst general manager in VSW, Bowser, not picking his top star, who's been a two-time Intercontinental Champion, even took him to the limit, and I beat Enderman on Halloween night. Everyone said, no, nah, do not mess with Enderman, and look what happened. Ah, won, and he came and picked me. What am I going to do, sit on sit in catering? But maybe I didn't pick you because I don't like what you re represent or that attitude of yours. Gorsh attitude? It's about wins, W's, and L's here in VSW, and that's what you want, and you're going to pick a scrum like Wuzzy? Hey, Goofy, if you have a problem with me, say it to my face. Gorsh, I'll say it to your face. You're a fraud. You're a fake Intercontinental Champion. That should be mine. And only if this big boy didn't take it from me, he's not even a competitor, I would still have that. And I said I was coming back for that, so Wuzzy, don't get comfortable. I believe you need to brush your teeth because you're spitting all over me. But if you want to match with this Aaron Connell Championship, you can have one. Gorsh, I'm going to get one, but not tonight because I'm not ready. And Bowser, you're going to give it to me, right? Well, I don't believe you've earned it, so I'll give you a chance to earn it in a Noble Contenders match. Gorsh, every time with this fool. Uh, what do you mean, earn it? I'm a former champion and I beat anybody last. Oh, trust me, when I get that shot, Wuzzy, I'm taking back my baby. As we clear the ring of that chaos, it is now time for our main event. SpongeBob and Patrick, who've been going at it for over a year now, off and on. What do you think about this rivalry and how it's gone so far? Patrick, I don't even know, honestly. <laughs> it started a feaster fight last year when SpongeBob turned on Patrick, and then they had another match a year later, a feaster fight this year. And they've even fallen off, they've knocked each other off the bed, taken off months off, off of their career. It's just been... Chaos, they even won the tag team titles. These two have been going at it. Hopefully they look to edit tonight here on Fireball. As Patrick yeah! makes it for this main event match here on Fireball. And Patrick is the YouTube champion, but he said, it's not about the title tonight. He's about to kick SpongeBob out of his life and this, get this rivalry <laughs> over with. Oh, oh my god. They were just rolling around there. And Patrick <laughs> saying SpongeBob is a joke. Remember their match at Feaster Fight just a couple of months ago? Patrick obliterated oh. SpongeBob in like a super one-sided matchup. Yeah. If we're knocking him down the bed side, oh! Patrick with a suplex. It's Spongebob! Ah! Jumping on the Patrick. 
I actually think this is going to be easy just for a or fight. Oh. But SpongeBob has come back with a new fire in his eyes, making his triumphant return in the Scrumble Rumble, eliminating Patrick. Oh, wow, really? And now, look at this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Like a reverse DDT. I don't even know what to call that move. Sponge, splash, sponge, splash. Sponge, sponge, splash, splash. Oh, the oh. senton from the top. And now a backflip. Oh, over a pin here and a kick out by Patch. Oh, my God. Who, who do you think is going to win this match? Oh, suplex from Patch. This is what, sorry, this is what Patrick does. He suplexes his opponents. It takes so much out of their opponents, don't you think? Oh, my God. I don't know. That, Patrick kind of turned his back on the fans as elite. So I think the fans probably want Spongebob to win. Yeah, like one year ago, it was kind of different. No. It was Spongebob who seemed like he was kind of just losing it. And he was mad at Patrick. And that's the other way around, kind of. Seems like Spongebob's calmed down about that now. All right now, but Spongebob countering Patrick straight down to a DDT from Spongebob. Don't want to like draw. Spongebob now setting Patrick up for the sponge splash. No, picking him up. Oh, my God. Face first goes Patrick into the back. Spongebob, Spongebob, Spongebob. Spongebob. Oh, he's going for that sponge splash. A series oh. of flips. Oh. Usually fall up one from the top rope. Put him away. Ten this right ah. one. Patrick is down. No. Not able to put him away. How did he kick out? Oh, and he's splashing in the corner. How did he kick out? Kicked out of the legendary sponge splash. Oh, oh no. You know this move he used to do for a while where he hurt people's necks and under. Oh, and Patrick countering it. Sponge are trying to go to desperate lengths now. And oh, my God. <laughs> Suplex into the wall. What a match this has been. Hopefully, this is the end of this rivalry. No. Honestly, I liked when these two were friends. No. Oh, one. Now here we go, Patrick. He's no. on a roller now with a series of suplexes, and now might bad, might go from bad to worse for SpongeBob. Oh no, to the top rope. Shades of Logan Paul. Oh, my God, Blaster. Oh, my God, Blaster. Yeah. I can't get out my SpongeBob. What a match you're witnessing here on Fireball. Don't cook away now. Go for another one, another one with blaster. Wait, Patrick, what's he doing? Oh, he wants to do it from a higher, a oh, higher no, fall. No, no it's SpongeBob. <laughs> Drop it away ah! a big splash. Big splash from SpongeBob. What's he gonna, what is he gonna do to put him away? Wait, where'd he go? Oh my gosh, the height of SpongeBob. Don't do it. Oh my ah! god. Big splash. Ending this rivalry once and for all. Sponge up with a big win here tonight on Fireball. Yeah, Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Look at that. We finally going to put this trouble past behind us. Sponge up going for a handshake. <laughs> to end this rivalry. To... Oh, Patrick, the emotion is too heavy for him right now. But Sponge is, is your winner here on Fireball. The way oh! What the heck? What was Sonic? What is happening? <laughs> Squidward and Sonic! I'm so confused! What, what is happening? Oh, no. What is happening? What? what is here? What the heck is going on? What, what is wrong? What the hell is going on? This, 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 it's a spike invasion! Spike just invaded the fireball! They just, oh my god! Who are my enemies? When they step up, we'll see. This is my evolution. Think me now, I won't leave you forsaken. See through my eyes, and I know you'll awaken. Reclaiming my voice so I won't be mistaken. Enter the walls of your brain like a breaking, but it ain't hidden, it's a source of relating.